Hi Year 7, it's Mrs V and we are back in the lab and today's experiment is called Water Holding Capacity. Now did you get your practical sheet? You need to download that, print yourself a copy or you can work electronically on the document. Alright, so today we have three types of soil. We have clay, loam and sand. And we're going to see which one of these soils holds water the best and which one just allows the water to run through it. Now, to make this a fair test, I've made sure that I have the same amount of each of the soils. And we are going to put them into a funnel that has some cotton wool in it to stop the dirt going through. Okay, so first of all, clay. Let's put our clay in here. Okay, I'm going to put the title the clay in front of there so we remember that's the clay. The next one is our loam. So I'm going to pour my loam in there and then I'm going to put the loam in front of that to remind me. Well, I might just put it right next to it. And the same with the clay, that way you won't miss out on what happens in the experiment. And then the final one is the sand. So I'm going to pour the sand in and put the sand next to them. Now I have measured, actually Miss Billing did the measuring, 40 mils of water and we're going to pour them through. But before we start, I want you to make your hypothesis. So pause the video and write down what you think is going to happen when I pour the water into these three soils. Okay, hypothesis done and we are ready to experiment. So, I'm going to take my 40 mils of water and I'm going to pour it onto the clay here. Just gently and slowly, I don't want to make a big mess everywhere. So I'm going to pour that on every little bit and I'm going to see how much water drips through. Okay, we're going to leave that one going and we're going to pour the water onto the loam. Okay, just gently, don't want to make a big mess everywhere. And then finally onto the sand. Again being gentle and careful so that I don't make a big mess. There's the sand. Oh, straight away with the sand I can see something happening, Miss Billingham. Mm, came through straight away. Oh, we the can see some coming started. through the loam as well. And some coming through the clay. What do you notice about how fast that water is dripping? Can you already see a difference happening? Okay, we're going to pause and we're going to come back to this and collect our results.